Air filter maintenance is one of the most important things you can do to keep your bike in good condition. Today we're showing you how to replace your air filter on your Honda CRF 300L. It's the same process for the rally and you should be doing this at least every 12,000 miles, but you're going to want to do it more often in dusty conditions. Now we're replacing the filter with the stock one today, but we have a foam filter option on our website if you're in off-road conditions all the time. So you might want to look into that. Click the link in the description below for either of these filters. But with all that said, this is simple to do. So let's go ahead and get started. First, we need to remove the seat by taking out the two bolts in the back. Then that'll slide right off. We've got a seat heater on ours, so we got to disconnect it. After that, remove the right side panel. We've got a plastic trim clip that was right underneath that seat. Then we've got a bolt on the side. We're using a five millimeter Allen to remove that. And then there's two tabs in grommets and we're just going to pull out on the side cover and it should pop right out. And we have five screws in the air filter cover. So right here we have the air filter. You can see this thing is caked with dirt. It's a little easier to see from the back, but to remove it, I'm just going to pop those two clips off and then slide it straight out. So as I pull that out, you can see how cake that thing is. The more dirt that is on here, the more restriction you're gonna have and the worse the engine's gonna run. You also wanna inspect it for any tears or damage. And if either of those conditions exist, you wanna get this thing replaced. And one little tip when you inspect it, if you're not sure if it's dirty or not, you can hold it up to the light and you just wanna look at the pleating and see how much light is coming through. The darker it is, the dirtier the filter is. So again, anything that's clogged up, you want to replace. Now, before I install the new air filter, I'm going to take a rag and some contact cleaner and just clean up that sealing surface. To install the filter, the screen side is going to be facing the front of the machine. And then we have these two tabs that are going to go in the slots in that air box. So make sure you line those up. Now, if you did get a foam filter, we've got a separate video that shows you how to clean and oil those. But for us, we've got this slid into place. I'm gonna look down in there with a flashlight and make sure it's sealing all the way around, which it is. So I can go ahead and reinstall my cover, the side panel, and the seat. And that's all it takes to get your bike breathing again. If you need an air filter, Click the link in the description below. If you have any questions, leave us a comment. And if you want to see more helpful content like this, subscribe to our channel. I'm Charles with Rocky Mountain ETVMC. Thanks for watching.